to the side of the bed close to his ear. And after the final amen from the, from the, from the man of God. After the final amen, you will check up to see that God has done it. And I went back to take the phone and I saw the legs was moving, was moving, was moving. And I left. Then on 26, that was on Friday morning, by 10 a.m., and the doctor called on us that something beyond medical sign happened. And we rushed to the ICU. At that point, B.O., B.O., Prince Will returned back to life. And all the organs returned back in a good shape and function. And then we give God the glory that my son that was dead after four days through the prayer of the man of God, my son returned back to life. Glory be to God. I thank God I'm alive and I'm with my family. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. I want a bit hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The Lord has done marvelous, wonderful things in our midst. I just want us to listen to one testimony. Just one testimony after the ministration of uh, the servant of God. We'll hear from more testimonies. But this time, just one testimony. Praise the Lord. In a snayang and in a ham, don't the precious. Nichoka could samba kwa William. Dinom Zambia Mamene Muno. Nenza kona problem for six years. Nenzo Dwala for six years. Banani Banani Perekako Kuma hospitals in Africa Kulevida Kuja. So Pastor Pevana Bwedava Pempera. Last prayer. Pevana Bwedava Kambacha. It's a man. Nabwela nam vera chin to cha choka mutupi mwanga so nabwela nam pamza bwela. So pari chojon se nyonga mlungu ziko mwana wa mulungu mutikanka la musuch mu situation yoi patizazi vala muni vonse veti chita, tikazi faka mulungu ksogoro skom. Praise the Lord. The sister here she is known as Precious Hamuduri Hamudutiri coming from Chilanga in Zambia. She says she has had a problem for the past six years. She has gone to various hospitals trying to seek for, for solution, but to no avail. And she heard from her neighbors that there is going to be a crusade at Hero Stadium. And the neighbors invited her to come. So when she came on Sunday, she sat somewhere. And where she sat, she started not feeling okay. And when she did not feel okay, suddenly she fainted, and then she was taken somewhere, and after that, she was brought in. And immediately, when the servant of God prayed the last prayer and the last amen, she felt something coming out of her body, and she got delivered. Praise the Lord. Pito pet na bwela ka fest bana kamba ti mutima wenzo vimba ko bati pet tayenda esta de ku UTH ya peze ka ma result ya richebu ino nyonga mulungu ziko mo praise the lord She has a results from the UTH from the hospital and when she went back to recheck they have found out that her results are just okay praise the lord Okay, so what she was describing was what we call a myocardial infarction. Basically, that's a disease of the heart. Okay, so she was having a problem with the heart. 
and the condition she was having was a myocardial infarction. Normally, we are able to catch that on ECG and echo, which are the results that she was show, she's shown us today. Uh, we were able to repeat that today at UTH here at the University Teaching Hospital, and both the ECG and echo were okay. So, yeah, thank you. Praise the Lord. Let's celebrate the power of God with a big clap. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. That's the miracle. And the Lord will visit you this evening in Jesus' name. Your miracle is on the way in Jesus' name.